sets the stage for reform uh, in, in education. If you talk to folks in the halls, uh, they say that would be the sleeper bill of the session in terms of the impact of what it has uh, for Missouri citizens. Didn't quite get there on health care. Uh, the Missouri Senate remains committed to providing coverage. Uh, we passed a piece of legislation that would have uh, provided coverage for 35,000 uh, low income working Missourians, uh, with the possibility of moving to 200,000 Missourians for health care coverage. We're disappointed, obviously, in that, but uh, that remains work uh, we will progress with in the future. As I said on the dais, uh, obviously, you do not get everything done in one session, and I think uh, we took a huge step forward, a very positive vote. Uh, on that piece. I uh, would like to thank uh, the Minority Leader Victor Callahan. Uh, I can tell you that uh, we worked very closely uh, together and he just did a tremendous job and uh, would like to turn over the dice to him. Well, I think that we uh, we did make tremendous progress. Uh, this nation faced a recession. It was of critical importance to the governor and the Senate and ultimately the legislation to pass the jobs bill. Uh, I think we got there for the most part. It's my hope that this creates jobs, creates quality jobs, and is part of general recovery. I also believe that the Missouri Senate uh, very effectively handled uh, the use of, of federal stabilization dollars and stimulus dollars. I think we did it in a very accountable, transparent way for our taxpayers, and uh, the Missouri budget and our economy is better off uh, by doing that. 